For the second year in a row, Southwest Division rivals meet up for a spot in the Northeast 10 Championship game. It's American International taking on New Haven. Early three-pointer on the way is good from Alexandria Kerr. Passes up the three to attack the rim. Hebert on the kick out, fires up a long range bomb and hits. Hebert's been a more willing and active rebounder as Bradford knocks down a three. And an early timeout coming from Kristen Hutchinson. Playing better down the stretch. Bishop tries to contest his three and hits. Can't imagine Bishop's gonna see that bench too much today. Nice cut to the rim. Big block though by OJ. Followed up by Watts. What a play by Watts that time. Shot A King racing through traffic. Kerr on the kick out, attacks the rim, lays it up and in. That bounce pass had to go through about three white shirts if it was going to reach its destination. Easter with a nice cut, gets the bucket oh, and the foul. Oh. Eventually taking control in the second half. Bishop, tough jumper, got it. Time on oh. Now Part of the reason they're back in the ball game now is the defense has picked up its tempo. Mason with a nice roll to the rim for two. Long lead pass, and Guyon lays it in. Timeout, New Haven. King will rush it across midcourt, finds Hebert off the screen, throws one up from the free throw line and hits. What an effort by Hebert to get that one away and make it a one point game at the half. Here's Bishop, guarded by Bradford, pulls up for a three behind the screen and knocks it down. Stepney from 19 knocks it down. Stepney, Bishop, quick trigger, splash. And now she is forcing her way into the game. Four of nine from behind the arc as she needs Stepney for a bucket here. Just to get back to that game and have a chance to win it. Certainly wouldn't be a surprise as Bradford nails a three. New Haven's not done yet though. Now it's a rebound there. You can take a little more time now. Another 25-30 off this game clock. Bishop finds Watts, grab, gets it anyway. Ten on the shot clock. Here's Mason. Backing in, the spin, the hang, and the hit. And the Yellow Jackets, for a second year in a row, are headed to the Northeast 10 Championship game. Rihanna Bishop led the way, 27 points, 10 assists. The senior will dribble out the corner. And the Yellow Jackets pick up their 25th win of the year, beating New Haven here in the semis, 75-67. All right, Coach Hutchinson, Rihanna Bishop here, the winners, advancing to the Northeast 10 title game we'll talk about that in just a moment but coach tell us a little bit about this game ups and downs it was a physical game how did you see it play out um well we outplayed them in three quarters except for that first quarter we got off to a really slow start and once we got into our game plan and really got after it on the defensive end um, our offense looked a lot better um, but give all the credit to new haven they're a great team they fought to the end everything was difficult for us and um, you know we we're just lucky that that we came through in the end coach you've fallen behind this team a couple times already this season last year you fell behind in the playoff game what is it about your team that gets off to slow starts against new haven um well they got two really really good players um you know and and we lose focus maybe in the beginning of the game i i'm not sure maybe that's how we draw it up in the locker room i don't know um but they they got terrific players and, and you know we got to get to get off to better starts and hopefully we can do that on uh, sunday and brianna bishop obviously great game 27 points brianna it seemed like you struggled a little bit early on in this game. They were throwing some double teams at you. It seemed like they were trying to keep the basketball away from you. How were you able to kind of fight through that? Um, I think it helps uh, to get my teammates involved when I start um, giving them assists and they start uh, making their shots. It just kind of helps take the pressure off of me and um, give all the credit to them because they did a great job of that. Brianna, so much size in your front court, so much depth. How much easier does that make your life when everything collapses inside and there's so much room around the perimeter for you to work? Uh, it makes my life a whole lot easier. Even um, I know that if I miss a shot, we're going to get the rebound, so I'm not scared to take them, so it's really nice. And Brianna, obviously last year in this game that you're coming up to play in, you guys had a tough one here. How's the motivation right now You know, to try to really end your career on a good note here and, and have a chance to win this game coming up? Um, it's really motivating because uh, we made it there last year and didn't finish, um, so I know all the seniors, even the newcomers, we want to get it done this year. The final score once again, AIC 75, 
New Haven 67. On behalf of my broadcast partner, Roy Biberstein, I'm Ben Alter saying good night from Springfield, Massachusetts, where the Yellow Jackets have advanced to the Northeast 10 Conference Championship.